When building a new computer, there are plenty of brands of computer components available for you to choose from. But has the thought ever occurred to you that why Intel and AMD are the only two CPU brands that are widely used on the desktop? Well, let's find out! It all began in 1981 when the first IBM personal computer integrated Intel's x86 instruction set to power up their computer. This personal computer was a huge success in the consumer market due to its simplicity and ease of use. Followed by this, programmers began working on codes and applications for this x86 system and that eventually pushed other competitors out of the market. Later on, Intel began licensing their x86 architecture to several other brands including AMD, Cyrix, and IBM to meet the rising demand of the architecture. At this point, Intel was an industry giant that dominated the market above everyone else. Eventually, Intel's x86 license to AMD backfired when AMD began improving on the x86 architecture and later came up with the x64 instruction set. Fast forward to current times, Intel and AMD have taken the CPU market by storm with their fierce competition. AMD's Ryzen processor lineup is giving Intel a hard time, while Intel's penetration on the laptop market is keeping AMD away for now. As the competition grew more and more, we are getting to see plenty of high-performing processors such as the upcoming 12th Gen Alder Lake from Intel and Zen 3 chips from AMD. Besides AMD, several other CPU brands also took licenses of the x86 architecture from Intel. One of them was Cyrix, who promised so many things to the users and failed to keep them at the end. We also have Apple's M1 chip that has superb efficiency while performing heavy workload, but sadly, it is exclusive to Apple devices. Looking at the mobile market, Snapdragon is currently in high demand among smartphone users as they mostly prefer it over other chips. But then again, it is limited to the smartphone industry. Although plenty of CPU companies do exist on the market, they come nowhere closer to what Intel and AMD have in store for the consumer sector. Also, years of expertise, knowledge, and loyal fan base has enabled these two companies to have a stronger footprint on the industry. Simply put, competing against these industry giants is a tough nut to crack. And that is why we get to see only two CPU companies on the market. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up. Share it with your friends and comment below to let us know your thoughts. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon if you want to see more videos like this on your feed.